Hey guys, one thing that comes to mind when I think of the year 1985 is the movie Back to the Future. Love that movie. Great movie. And love the song. The song's from the movie. So here we have... The song from Back to the Future by Huey Lewis and the News called uh, The Power of Love. Great song. Okay, so there is not any piano to my knowledge in this song, but it works on piano. We, a lot of things will work on piano if we just can transcribe it correctly to make it sound right. So we are combining the electric guitar with distortion, we're combining the bass line, we're combining the, the brass that's in it, and also uh, electric guitar sound, electric guitar with a little chorus on it maybe. So uh, making it work on piano. Piano is unique that way in that it can kind of uh, imitate instruments better than, than any other instrument I think. So uh, that's why I like being a piano player, one of the reasons. We're going to start with a CFA, because that's what the brass does. Alright, so we're going to play CFA, and then we're going to play CEGC, and then we're going to play GCE, and then ACF. So we have, and then repeat. That's my idea, of, that's my sign for a, a repeat sign, is going back. Okay, so that's the right hand. Make sure you play it short. I forgot to introduce myself. I am Sean Cheek. Welcome to my Easy Piano Lessons. I have a website called webpianoteacher.com. The rest of this song is on my website right now if you want to go check that out. If you're not interested in being a member on the website, then here's the free part one for you. hope you enjoy it. Make sure you play... Play it short, because if you play a brass instrument, you know, you have a strong attack, bop, bop, and then cut off, bop, bop. All right, on the left hand, we're imitating the bass and the electric guitar with distortion. All right, <clears throat> the guitar's probably doing power chords, so we're just going to do octaves here. I have this G octave in parenthesis because we're not going to play it the very first time. But we're going to play it from then on when we do the repeat and so forth. But let's start here with the C octave. And I'm playing really low down here, if you can even see that on the video. You can do it here if that bothers you. I was just doing it down here for more, uh, you know, thickness. matter of personal taste there, okay? So you want to start with the C octave. Here, C on the top, C on the bottom. Give me three of those. One, two, three. That's why I have a three there. Going up to the E octave, give me three of those. One, two, three. And then give me two more E octaves. Two. One, two. Now give me three F octaves. One, two, three. And then three G octaves. One, two, three. So one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then when you repeat back, you will play this G octave. One, two, so it's one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three, 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 one, two, three. And each time you have an octave, you want to punch it a little bit. One, two, three, 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 C chord, we start the octave. One, two, three, one, two, three. Here we play together. One, two. And then one, two, three, one, two, three. And here, one, two, one, two. See how we play it on the repeat? One, two, one, two, three, one, two, three. Or pedal in there if you have a pedal on your keyboard or your piano. You can add a little bit, but not too much. Don't do this. Oh, that's bad. 
don't do that. Just a little here and there. Alright, uh, so there's the intro there for it. Really fun to play. Uh, again, the rest of this song is on my website, because we all got to make a living, right? Uh, so I, I give you the free part one for those of you who are just wanting a little taste, just wanting something to work on today. And if you want uh, a lot more videos, of course I have, you know, uh, lots and lots and lots of videos on my website. You can also find me on Facebook. If you like more videos like this one, I have almost 300 videos for free on, on my Facebook fans page. Okay? They're not on YouTube, they're on my Facebook fans page uh, for free. They're all labeled. Um, and you find me on Facebook. Do a Google search for Web Piano Teacher, one word, and then the next word's fans, Web Piano Teacher, fans, or do a Facebook search, if you're already on Facebook, uh, for www.webpianoteacher.com. Or if you want to see them on YouTube, I do have them on this YouTube channel. Uh, it's youtube.com slash Sean Cheek Piano and I have the videos on YouTube there. Uh, they're just harder to find because the name of the song is not in the title there. But anyway, here it is one more time. Okay, great song from 1985. Great song, great movie, great band. And uh, reminds me of a good time. So, hope you guys enjoy that one.